Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan. In this very exciting video of algebraic challenging expressions, here we are going to solve one very interesting Olympiad problem from radicals. So let's get started. 5 plus square root 5 whole power 9 plus 5 minus square root 5 whole power 9 we have to simplify. I am going to use the substitution and see this is our A and this is bracket is B. So what we have to calculate actually or find out that is a power 9 plus b power 9. Okay. Now if we have to find out a power 9 plus b power 9 then we know that a and b value. So what I will write a is equal to 5 plus square root 5 and b is equal to 5 minus square root 5. I will add both the equations. I will get a plus b equal to 10. Now from this set of equation, I will take product also a dot b. So that value will be 5 plus square root 5 and 5 minus square root 5. Now you know that difference of square formula a plus b times a minus b. I will use that a square minus b square. So here our a is 5, b is square root 5. This is a minus b. So a square minus b square. 5 square minus square root 5 whole square. So that will give us 25 minus 5. That means 20. Okay. I have used here identity. a square minus b square is equal to a plus b times a minus b the difference of square identity now ultimately what we have equation number one that is a plus b equal to 10 equation number two a times b equal to 20 and we have to find out the value of a power 9 plus b power 9 so let's get started by considering whole square so I will write here first a plus b whole is square equation 1 is square so 10 is square. I will use identity a square plus b square plus 2ab it should be equal to 100. Done. Now we know ab value so I will put here 20. So a square plus b square plus 2 times 20 equal to 100. So a square plus b square plus 40 which will be equal to 100. Now I will take 40 to the right. So I can collect a square plus b square value that will be 60. And this is our equation number 3. So mainly I will use 1, 2, a plus b, a times b and a square plus b square. So let's find out cube terms first. Let me write here. We know that a plus b equal to 10, a times b equal to 20 and a square plus b square is equal to 60. Done. Now I am going to use the third identity that is a cube plus b cube formula. So I will write here a cube plus b cube equal to a plus b times formula a square plus b square minus ab. Let's put the value a plus b is 10. So I will write here 10 second bracket a square plus b square is 60. I will put 60 minus ab is given to us 20, 40, 40 times 10, 400. So this is our equation number 4. Let me write here a cube plus b cube equal to 400. Now our target is to find out the value of a power 9 plus b power 9. So I will consider if you will go by the path of a power 5 plus b power 5. 
then we need to calculate 7 also. So what I will do, I will consider the cube of this equation. a cube plus b cube is 400. Let's take cube both sides. So I will write a cube plus b cube whole cube. So right hand side also 400 cube. Now we know that the formula identity. Let me write here a, a plus b whole cube first or p plus q whole cube identity which is p cube plus q cube plus 3 p q in bracket p plus q. This is what we know. Let's apply here. So I will write this equation as a cube, so a power 9 plus b cube, p cube, so b cube I will write b power 9 q cube plus 3 p cube. What is p? p is a cube, b cube. So I will write 3 times a cube, b cube, 3 p cube is done. Now p plus q, that means a cube plus b cube. Okay, and right hand side will be 400 cube. Let's put the value a cube b cube. See, ab is 20. So I can write a cube b cube value. Let me write here a9 plus b power 9. That would be equal plus not equal to a cube b cube. So I will write 20 whole cube. a cube plus b cube that we have evaluated 400 equal to 400 whole cube. Now we have to only simplify the a9 plus b9 term. So let me write here a9 plus b9 plus what I should write 8000. This is 20 cube. So 8000 times 400 equal to 400 whole cube. This dot, dot means multiplication. Let's take away 3 times 8000 times 400 both sides. So I can write in my left hand side it would be a9 plus b9. Right hand side will have 400 cube minus 400 times 3 times 8000 24000. Now I will take 400 common out. So what would be left? 400 square minus 24,000. Okay. So 400 it will be as it is. 400 square. So it is 1,60,000. One more zero. Yes. Minus 24,000. It will give us 4,400 times. See what would be left if I will take away 24,000 from 160,000. It would be 1,36,000. 1, 2, 3. So if I will convert this figure into million, then it would be come out 54.4 million. Zeros are there. Or you can write this one as 54,400,000. Both, both answers are right. 54.4 million or 54,400,000. This would be the value of a power 9 plus b power 9 which was asked. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care.